this video, I'll show you what a combined mean is. I'll also show you how to calculate it for two groups or more than two groups. A combined mean is a mean of two or more separate groups. The basic steps are calculate the mean of each group, then combine the results. The formula for the combined mean has a few different parts to it. X of A is the mean of the first set. M is the number of items in the first set. X sub B is the mean of the second set. And N is the number of items in the second set. For more than two groups, it gets a bit more complicated. You have to add the means of each group, each weighted by the number of individuals or data points. Then you divide that sum by the sum total of all individuals or data points. In this first example, we'll look at two groups. Suppose you have a survey on math proficiency with results from two different schools. M is the number in the first group, that's 57. I'm going to multiply that by the mean score, which is 82. Then we're going to add 23, that's the number of items in the second group, multiplied by the mean of the second group, that's 63. And this is all going to be over M, the number of items in group 1, that's 57, and N, was the number in the second group, that was 23. That gives me a combined mean of 76.5. In this next example, we have data from five schools. For our combined mean, we're going to multiply the number of students by the average time, and we're going to sum all of those up, and divide that by the sum of column two, which is the total number of students. So if I put this into a calculator, I'm going to multiply 189 by 83. I'm going to add 46 times 121. And add 89 times 82. Plus 50 times 147. And 12 times 60. I've put in an extra set of parentheses here to total that all up, and I'm going to divide that by the total number of students, which I'm going to get by summing up that center column. The combined mean for this set of five scores is 94.87. If you found the video helpful, please take a moment to subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.